Hello everyone. Hello, hello, and welcome back to uh, Let's uh, Knife Run Resident Evil 2. I'm of course the Black Shadow. And I have to admit, last video was pretty damn successful actually. Uh, we uh, journeyed all the way through the vacant factory and had uh, a really, really good showing actually against uh, William Birkin, our first uh, fight with him in this uh, LP series. It will not be the last, but uh, yeah, we got through really well. And as such, we're in decent shape. We've got some extra health items in our back pocket along with the goodies we have here. And yeah, I'm really, really pleased with it, folks. But we've still got a bit of work to do. Uh, we are now um, just about to delve into the Umbrella Labs. We, of course, need to pick up um, a vaccine for a Sherry. And looming in front of us is a lot of death and misery. Uh, I'm deciding to try and run on, on Orange Caution in the hope that I can take a hit and use a full healing item. That's the logic here, folks. We'll have to see how that goes. Anyways, yes. Yeah, so, um, so that's what we've got there. And how much have I got again? I need to remember. We've got two first aid sprays and a green red mix. So we've got five healing items on. Take one out. We've only got about four-ish healing, um, full heals at the moment. We're gonna need a little bit more than that before we get through. There are some healing items for us to pick up here, certainly. But, um, work to do, folks. Work to do. Now, I am hoping that I remember how to, um, find my way around the Umbrella Lads. Because it has been an incredibly long time since I did all this. Um, and I must admit, I don't remember it too well. I know that this is, um, completely locked off. Um, folks, so uh, we won't be touching that in this game. Let's delve inside. Alright. Can't see too well because it's quite bright out at the moment. Don't think there's any particular items hiding around at the moment there. We don't want to go in the red corner, we want to take the blue passageway first should be significantly safer. Because we've got all these shutters here that we need to um, unlock. Uh, we need to get the power up and running, folks. And mind you, I also need to get the guest prints running as well, don't I, for the B game. That'd be a good thing. This door is also locked. Need a card key for that. It's the cold storage room we will need to delve into. Hi! That's a good find. Thank you. Might need a bit of defrosting, but hey, here's the fuse case. We need to use this in order to restore power to the, uh, to the world. Use that on the machine here. And it will very kindly... And rather expertly... Do whatever the hell it is it's doing. It works. I'm not complaining. Main fuse. Thank you, Mr. Machine. You have yourself a good day now. No secret items hiding on the ground, by the way, really. Um, you know, no broken shotguns for uh, David fixed and then forgot about while playing online. So, let's get this baby up and running. Beautiful. There's no need for us to go back in the blue corridor for the time being, so we're going to head down the red one now. I don't know if this place is immediately safe or if it, um, the enemies are hidden behind the shutter. I believe they're hidden behind the shutter. Yeah, so as long as we don't open that, we're safe in here. That's locked from inside. And then this we can open from right here. Ah, yes. That. User registration! We'll be needing this, folks, um, in order to do things later on in the game. 
So, uh, yeah. We'll file that under there. And over here, we have got... The Lab Security Manual. Again, I'll let you uh, have a pause and read these as you need to go. Yeah, escape measures will be directed towards the underground transport facility. All materials will automatically be transported from the landing zone to a designated high-speed train, at which point all materials will be isolated and disposed of immediately. The entire train will be purged and disposed of without delay, which is bad. Um, yeah. Various escape passages... Uh, the route will skew passage to the relay point outside the city limits. Ooh. This is top priority to keep all research classified. Escape under may is access. Blah, 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 blah. Um, escape access may be denied under certain extenuating circumstances. So this fun little bit of the game. So it's all over price. Now you can, if you wish, if you have the lighter with you. You can use that to light said oil. And you can torch the vines. Beautiful. I don't think there's anything much in any of these beds or anything, I don't believe. Um, there is, of course, lying in these lockers. Uh, well, there's a bow gun bolt here. But I believe in Leon's game, you can get hold of a flamethrower. Uh, which is not a bad little weapon against a lot of plant-like enemies in this area of the game. They will wreck you. It's not great. Now, I don't think there's any need for us to go in here. Let me just um, throw down a handy-dandy save point here. But I don't believe there's any reason for us to head into here. There are um, munitions, like grenade rounds and stuff, which is nice. However, there are two super lickers, which will wreck my shit. I'm just gonna run here and just see what's in here. Yeah, two sets of grenade rounds. There's absolutely no need to be in here, so we won't bother. On top of this, folks, we also have this here, the anti-BOW gas sprinkler. Now, you can turn this on. This is completely optional, folks. And this will release a, uh, a gas throughout the majority of the lab, folks. Designed, and it's designed to uh, make, uh, you know, to affect um, BOWs that are on the loose. Uh, mainly speaking, it will weaken the uh, liquors somewhat, folks, which is good. However, it has the um, the unfortunate side effect that any all of the plant enemies um, around the vine things we're about to run into, they then become poisonous. They are not poisonous otherwise. So it depends which way you want to go. I think we're going to leave it off because we're not exactly going to be fighting any of these guys. We're not in a position to kill them. And also the fact that I don't actually have any blue herbs on me. Just these blue um, herb planters which are... In a couple of places. And I'd rather just not deal with that. We're not really going to be fighting liquors anyways. Um, so we're just going to run with this. And not to. But yeah. A lot of people just go and just think. Oh I'll turn this on. And the BOW sounds good. But it does have some consequences. Alright. So raise up the shutter switch. Which will reveal. Bad times. I don't know if I can take a hit from these guys. Well, we're not going to find out, because <laughs> I just ran past them. But bye. Now, is there a herb here? There is a herb here. I don't know if I can get it. There are two herbs there. i got to come back up here later. We'll collect them on the way past. Of course, we've got the humongous Plant 42. Um, or, not Plant 42. This is... Um, it's the similar sort of thing. Um, but we can't do anything with it just... Not in this game, folks. Although technically it should already be dead, but... We'll ignore that. Oh, boy. This could get miserable. Yeah. Not sure how I'm going to get past this situation. Please turn around. Yep. 
he is, which is good. Just a matter of... Oi, where are you going? Are you going to huddle on this... Oh, shit. Sir? I really request you stop doing this. Ah, oh, fuck. I'm going to have to leave and come back and see where he's respawned, aren't I? I mean, I can certainly attempt running through this area, but not really from there. I don't like the sound of that. And again, I'm trying to, like... You know, if I take a hit, I, I don't know if I can take a hit and survive. Besides, they're going to just try and take my head off, I suspect, so. I bet it's around the corner, I just die. Fucking hell, it is just around the corner. Okay, right. I'm going to have to run it, which sucks as well, because there's um, a good amount of healing items in this room. Don't know if I can stealth my way past this. Nope. Bye. Continue to run. Well, I took the hit, which is good. Run. Run, 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 run. Yeah, that was a bad situation, everyone. More herbs, and again, I have to go back from later on. But hey, I got the hit out of the... I got a spare hit out of that, so uh, that wasn't too bad. I'll take that. Alright, then we've got a mod here. I believe this gives us the map of the labs. Which it does indeed. Very nice. There's a, that needs a key card up there, as does the door up there as well. Stupendous. Right, we might as well drop off the first aid spray, because I don't really need that right now. The lighter can now go, we will never need that again. We'll take the weapon box key with us, because we may have some use out of this, though. That'd be nice. We shall head in through here. Is this place safe? I guess. It looks reasonably safe. Ooh, hi, Red Herb. I forgot you existed. So if we find any more Red Herbs or anything like that, there are um, about four Green Herbs we've walked past. We'll have to come back later on so we can mix them. All right. This is where the weapon box key goes, by the way. Open it up. Is there anything good in here? Nope, just um, two sets of grenade rounds. We cannot use that. Okay. Never mind. Over here, there are is another first aid spray. I thought there was actually handgun rounds. Good thing I checked. All right, so now we need to get our way through these set of rooms and pick up whatever is in the back. I forget what it is. I think the, the car key's back here, isn't it? I can't remember exactly. Anyways, we're going to have to uh, get through here, which could be tricky because... There are undead all over the place. Now, because these are motion sensor doors, the zombies can freely go between doors. There is no limitations on them for that. I thought there was a zombie coming through there. That would have been bad. There we are. There's, this is the machine we'll need for the vaccine sit for the vaccine for uh, Sherry, but we need to get hold of the initial components first. Go get the base vaccine first, which I know where to get that. We won't be getting it here. Here's the lab car key. We'll be needing that for sure. Now we just need to get out of here alive. If it's just the one zombie in here, that's cool with me. He's there. Oi, you! Thank you. That actually worked itself out pretty well. I hear that. And oh, now, hi! You killed William. I'll never forgive you for that. He attacked me! I've just prepared a sample of the G virus. And this time. No one will take it from me. 
This is the most significant piece of research my husband has ever left in my hands. Stop it! Sherry's in serious trouble. William implanted her with his embryos. There's no telling when they'll pupate. And if that happens, then Sherry won't... won't... What? William... I think she's just completely deluded now. That is not your husband. William, you're alive. Bang! Uh, I think you can class William them officially divorced, alive. folks. He's getting stronger with each skin he casts off. Sh Sherry! Tell me what I need to know. How can I save Sherry? I have detailed information. Everything you need to know to prepare the antidote is right here. We'll, uh, we'll read that in two seconds. Save my daughter. And tell her I'm sorry I wasn't a better mother. Tell her I love her. Sherry. Uh, Annette! Self-destruct sequence has been activated. Repeat, the self-destruct sequence has I haven't heard this for a while. This sequence may not be aborted. All employees proceed to the emergency car at the bottom platform. Oh dear. Right then! <laughs> I suppose you better get reading this file, hadn't we, wherever it is. Is that one? That's the one. So, uh, yes, we can, of course, um, create a vaccine to um, stop the bad things that are currently going on. Sherry! Uh, yes, for procedure details its synthesis. We need hold of the base vaccine um, first, which we put into uh, entry cartridge into the VAM. Uh, once that's done, we can then take that down to the synthesis machine we just looked at, um, which we just put it in. It'll run the program, and then we'll have ourselves uh, the actual vaccine, which we can look to give to Sherry herself. At least that's the logic, right? Before we go ahead and do that, of course, however, we want to make a swing over this direction. Use the lab car key. I love this music so much. I hope you do, because we're going to be hearing this for a few minutes. Oh yeah, giant moth here, by the way. Ah, shit. Please don't kill me. Oh, bastard. I've got a lock on there, which is not helping. I was trying to stab the damn things. I need to get to that machine. Thing is, he can poison me. That's bad news, if he does that. There we go. Operate the computer. We've got to go to the embryos thingies on there. My username, of course, as the file told us we should put in, is guest. Which will temporarily um, allow our fingerprints to be registered. Guest registration is valid for 24 hours. That will be of use to us, hopefully. Sweet. Right, so let's go ahead and get working on building up our vaccine, shall we? Also dealing with getting past these frickin' liquors. So, we're gonna drop some stuff off. We're gonna drop off the first aid spray. And we're actually going to drop off both of these because we've got loads of health items to pick up. We've got a lot of things we're going to start lugging around here, so we're going to run with those. Oh yes, this bit. The cause for the self-destruction system, by the way. You'll see that in the B game. Hi, Leon! Hi! Never mind that right now. Leon, you have to go back and get Sherry for me. I left her in the security office. Please, you 
There you go, Leon. You got your marching orders, mate. So uh, he'll go off and attempt to get hold of uh, Miss Birkin. And we need to get through this nasty situation with more liquors. It's a bit easier from this way because you've got more maneuverability. That is still a bit tight for my liking. And we'll have to come back through this way in a moment. Oh my goodness. Grab these. Luckily, there's one less liquor. I believe if you uh, play this on Leon, a third liquor will attack you uh, when you come back through there, through the roof. But on uh, Claire's game, uh, there's only the two, which is nice. I think that's all there is. Oh, make that a fourth liquor. There's already three here. Ah, oh, shit. Hi! Bye, 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 bye! <laughs> Luckily, they're turning circle is trash, so. Alright, let's get up here. Oops. Do want to try and get hold of the green herbs that are up here now. This could prove interesting. Please don't kill me. Yeah, be careful. The vine, if you go right behind it, the vine does like this whole. It turns back in on itself, little thing, which is actually quite cool, but is incredibly obnoxious. Obnoxious, I should say. Right, again, get past him. They're not, they're not so dangerous. The fact when they can't poison you, they're all right. Um, but yeah, they're they're a pain in the ass to kill because they're pretty resistant to gunfire. So that's a bit of a problem. Right, combine these up here. There's no need to go back to the um, to the towards the safe room there. Um, I think we'll find Sherry's already gone, anyways. And I think the room now is just infested with zombies as well. So we don't really need to deal with this. Push the shutter switch. Which we need to do in order to register our first fingerprint. go. Commencing with a secondary fingerprint verification, which of course we can't do because we need a second person. So, yeah, Leon can do all that in the B game. As for us, we now need to swing into here. This room is going to be pretty dangerous as well. We need to do this to bit the base vaccine, which is over here. There's the empty cartridge. There are zombies all over the joint here. We are going to take some damage. I don't really know what I can do about this. Yep. So we set that. There is something back there, but I don't know what it is. Oh, shit. i got to get on the other side to activate the machine. Yeah. This is... Um, there's not much I can do about this, folks. This is just... A lot of zombies are here. How the frick? Oh, I was about to say, how did I just find that gap? No idea. I'll take it. Right, there's also the MO disc here, I believe, on the machine. I have to take another hit here. Oh, this is... They're really annoyingly spaced here. We need the MO disc so we can get out of here, though. I just got to take hits here. Oh, my God. Six hits. Wow. Health item just pissed away. That sucks. I think I've got enough health on these that we can take that, but that... Uh, that was a really bad room. That was a really, really bad room. And then we're not done, because I haven't got the thing, have I? I've still got to get the uh, base vaccine. Wow, I took some damage. That was bad. They were just all really awkwardly spaced, so that I like I push one off, and then like the next one just comes up behind and just attacks me again. That was bad chaining. I should have taken a bit more care. Never mind. I think we'll just about be okay inventory space-wise, but I need to not take any more damage now. I basically need to get through the rest of this without getting hit. Anything we lose now, we're uh, we're in trouble. 
Please don't grab me. Yeah. Thankfully, the other vine monsters down the other side of the corridor. We don't need to go back soon. That's like the first really awful run we've had entire this entire run. It's the first really bad one. So hopefully we can shake it off. We've we've done pretty well. I, I, to be fair, considering this is the by uh, sorry, the first time I've ever um, oh fuck me, there's zombies. Oh shit! I forgot there were zombies in here. Oh my god. Do I try and down some of these guys? The skinless ones, which are really slow. Uh... Yeah, the, the skinless ones are really slow, so you can... You can down them and do some damage. This is a bad situation. You know what? I'm actually willing to take this. Whatever. Whatever. Right, the rest of them are there. Barrel this. Hi! Yeah, see this vent bit's already come down. That's uh, where it comes down to attack uh, Leon, the other liquor. Wow, look at that, folks. We actually had some use of the knife outside of a boss fight, folks. Would you believe it? All right, then. So back here. Yeah, so let's just check how much we got in one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, so we're okay. It was a hideous room, but we've... It was the only hideous room, so we were able to get away with that mess. Right out. Let's get in here. Run this, of course, so we can get hold of the vaccine. Shouldn't I have used the MO disc? Never mind. We'll do that in a moment. Hi, Net. Of course, there's still going to be zombies all around in here going to make my life very sad. Hopefully we can get our way through these again. We need to lure this zombie in here. Please don't do that. Oh shit. Shit! Ugh. That was kind of, uh, that was kind of unfortunate spawning. The other guy decided to go a little faster than I had planned. Oh well, anyways, we'll take the base vaccine. Pop that in here. Run the machine. I love it. it gives you the option. Do you want to press the switch? No, I don't. I'd actually rather not complete the game. Never mind. Anyways, there we go. Vaccine for Sherry. Now we just need to get the hell out of here. And hopefully not die. That'd be great. I really don't want to take any more damage. I li we are literally on like all the health supplies we've got now. Is that all of them? I think there's another guy still here. No? Alright, okay, not bad. Right. I'm actually, I'm, I'm pretty happy that I've got this far. I I was so concerned when I started this run that the crocodile was just going to end me and I wouldn't get past it. But we've got to the end of the, of the A game and we're in a decent shape, folks. I'm pretty happy. So let's go start stocking up on goodies. First aid sprays. Those. Now, I forget if I can use the MO disc and then come back and get a health item. We're going to go and quickly check, because if so, I would very much like to take that. I, I honestly don't remember if the game forces you through the door or not. So we're just going to throw a save state down just in case. Hi, zombie. Open that up with the MO disc there. 
No, we can still retain control. Awesome. All right, folks. So that is going to be the end of our video here. And uh, we have just one more left to do. We've um, I've managed to get my way all the way to the end of the A-game, folks. We have one final confrontation left to face. And uh, my understanding is that this is going to be hard. <laughs> and one day, I'm going to remember it's memory card too. Then mine. So, thank you guys so much for watching. And yes, next time, folks, can I bring the A game to a close? Can we defeat Birkin one more time? Or maybe I should be saying two more times. I'll see you later. <laughs>